Ukrainian startup Sorbiforce has made a major breakthrough by transforming agricultural waste into a metal-free organic battery prototype, in an attempt to combat the environmental impact of conventional batteries. Apart from agricultural waste, the Arizona-based energy storage company claims they use nothing but carbon, water, and salt to develop what they say is the world's first truly sustainable battery. The team, led by material scientist Sergei Kaminsky, Sorbiforce CEO and co-founder, came up with the idea after realizing agriculture generates up to 2.1 billion tons of waste each year. The limited and often hazardous methods of recycling conventional batteries further highlighted the urgent need for safer, more sustainable solutions. To create the innovative battery, Kaminsky gathered a team of experts in the late 2010s, which eventually earned them a place in the University of Arizona Center for Innovation Startup Incubator. Following years of research, the team developed sorption batteries that used three physical processes to transfer electrons through an ultraporous carbon layer at the core, moving them from the cathode to the anode. Since both electrodes are made of carbon, the battery is totally non-flammable. However, what's perhaps most striking is that at the end of a cell's life, as much as 95% of the battery can be broken down into organic materials, while the rest of the components can later be reused. Additionally, unlike lithium-ion batteries, which often become toxic plastic waste or pose safety hazards when recycled, Sorbiforce cells pose no risk of explosion, thermal runaway or toxic leaks thanks to their metal-free chemistry and closed-loop design, even if cut in half. As the startup gears up for its initial 60 to 150 kilowatt-hour pilot projects, slated for the second half of the year, it is currently seeking to raise 5 million US dollars in seed funding before the round closes. The low costs and high demand will help the company expand rapidly. With a lifespan exceeding 6,000 cycles and the ability to stack modules, moving from pilot projects to full-scale manufacturing is simply a matter of learning, as the demand is already there. There's a big need to develop technologies that are non-flammable, non-explosive and made in the US, so the company plans to begin rolling out its first batteries later this year through initial sales.